here eating breakfast and I forgot to record my Texas waffle and behind me we have Lucas with Olivia. So today we're gonna get ready to fly back to Brazil with Olivia. So we finally did our checking. We ended up checking in our five bags. It wasn't as hard as we thought it was gonna be because we had the little cart and a guy helped us get it to the check-in. I already changed her diaper and while we were doing all of that we had her carrier which is hanging right there and we were able to check in her stroller and everything and she's about to cry but here we are just waiting. We have like an hour and a half to go until we can finally board. Right my babies? Right my babies? I went to go check in our stroller and they already put the tags on it so we're actually gonna drop it off as we board and then we're gonna pick it up at every stop but our luggage is gonna go straight forward the only bad thing is that they're not letting us uh, board early I don't know why they told us we have to wait until the second zone and there's five so that kind of sucks because we thought we were gonna be able to go a lot earlier it's better than zone five so right now Olivia just ate again and Lucas is trying to burp her to Mexico and it was literally the worst experience ever so first of all this airport sucks because they don't have free Wi-Fi and they don't have AC so we were sweating carrying like four bags carrying Olivia pushing the stroller so it was like really bad we are waiting for our food at Chili's and then Chili's was extremely hot and then Olivia started crying because she was wearing a long sleeve and she was getting really fuzzy so we had to change her while we were eating at Chili's and she finally calmed down a little bit she is falling asleep and Lucas is having a lot of back pain does not want to talk because he's really frustrated he says he's never traveling again until Olivia's at least one I don't think it's that bad it is pretty bad but not as bad as Lucas says it is now we just have to wait here for two more hours we've been here for two hours and then we're gonna go to Sao Paulo I wanted to say we didn't record it because it was too much of a hassle when we were getting inside the airplane we didn't have time and then while we were getting ready for takeoff I was breastfeeding Olivia because I thought she was gonna cry she is a trooper she didn't cry at all on her first flight I wish I would have recorded it we did take pictures though and also I'm like super self-conscious because I'm wearing some dress pants and they make my shirt look gross <laughs> so I'm walking around with like a weird upper side on our way to our of getting the seat with the bassinet thing that goes on top so it has a little bit more space so Lucas is happy about that we're here with little Olivia we changed her into her long sleeve because we don't want her to get cold we're just waiting to be able to go to the restroom to change her diaper and then they'll bring her bassinet when we're up in the air which is gonna go right in front of us right there Lucas is in a bad mood because his back hurts that you're in a bad mood because your back hurts. Yeah, it just does. So close and so far. Plane 
we were on. So Olivia ended up crying a lot when we were descending and landing in Sao Paulo. So we got really nervous, like we didn't know what to do. But now we already got our bag. We have Olivia here. And we're gonna get ready to take our connecting flight to Curitiba. It's, really cold, Paulo, it's Curitiba really cold. It's gonna be worse. But I don't think she's cold. She has her little hat. She has her little shoes. We forgot to put our gloves. Olivia and I are waiting for Lucas to grab the bags. So here we have all of our bags. Struggling to push everything because we have so much stuff. And yeah, let's see how this goes. So it's already the next day and we're on our way to our apartment, which is going to be the first time we see it. Well, Olivia's room. So show, we're gonna show them the luggage bags. <laughs> so we have the luggage bags all behind us. It's five bags. So we're going to unpack and do all of that today. We left Olivia with her grandma, Lucas' mom. 